let's go ahead and get started. Hey, Jeff. So last week we were going over different um, terms for like springtime. So let's continue with that. So the word for spring. Uh, ooh, heat, hadub. Ooh, heat, hadub. So you've got those two glottal stops. So you're going to, especially with this one, it's going to be like a stop before you say the rest of it. Ooh, heat, hadub. Or you can, oh, heat, hadub. I've heard it both ways. Oh, heat, hadub. Or ooh, heat, hadub. Either or. Then we have us got hub. Sunny. Us got hub. Remember those cues are back of the throat. Us got hub. Us got hub. And then us shahwab. Us shahwab. And that is windy. So us, make sure you're making both those S sounds, the regular S and then the sh sound. Remember when it's got that wedge above it, it makes a sh sound. Us shahwab. Us shahwab. So we have ooh he hadab. Ooh he hadab. Us gut hub. Us gut hub. Us shafwab. Us shafwab. And then we have ooh kalb, which is the weather this morning. Rainy or raining. Ooh kalb. Ooh kalb. Whoops, remember that cues back of the throat. The upside down E's are called schwa's and they make an uh sound. Ooh, kolb. Ooh, kolb. We have a skak up. A skak up. That's a fun one to roll around in your mouth. That's cloudy. Us cock up. So you've got that um glottalized cue that's still the back of the back of your throat, and it's a <coughs> sound. Us cock up. And that running man, remember that comes from the back of your teeth. Us cock up. Us cock up. We've got a lot of clouds this morning too. We had a little taste of spring and then it went back to like clouds. Clouds and rain. Bokwob. Bokwob. Snowy or snowing. Ubokwob. Ubokwob. Remember those A's are ah. Ubokwob. And the U's can make two different sounds, the U or the O. And in this word, they make both ubakwob, ubakwob. So let's go through our, let's run through our little list. Uhi hadab, uhi hadab, us gut hub, us gut hub, us shafwab. Remember the X with the little floating W you're going to be blowing out? Us shafwab. Us shafwab. And then ukhalb. Ukhalb. Us kakab. Us kakab. Ubakhob. Ubakhob. Remember, anything that's got that little floating W, you're going to be rounding your mouth and blowing out. Ubakhob. Ubakwob. Um, next we have
Quadib. Make sure I spell that right. And that is thunder. Quadib. Quadib. We've got two floating W's, so you should be rounding your mouth. Um, the X with the wedge <clears throat> on top is that <laughs> sound. When you've got that floating W, you're going to be blowing out when you make that sound. <laughs> And uh, same with the Q, it's back of the throat, but you're still going to be blowing out. And then Hatsatsu, which is our word for lightning. Hatsatsu. So remember the C's in Lashutsi, they make that T-S sound, katsatsu. And you've got two of them here, katsatsu, katsatsu. Um, hold on, oh, my list, see if there's anything else I'd like to add. And here's one. Squishab. Squishab. That is fog. Squishab. Squishab. I think that covers all. Oh. I almost forgot. Well, let's go through the list first, and then I'll add the next two. Ooh, heat hudub. <clears throat> Ooh, heat hudub. Us gut club. Us gut club. Us shafwab. Us shafwab. Ukhulb. Ukhulb. Us kakub. Us kakub. Ubakwob. Ubakwob. Khwekwadib. Khwekwadib. Katsatsu. Katsatsu. And squashab. Squashab. Next. Obach shed word for rainbow. Quo, it's got three parts. Quo, botch, shud. Quo, botch, shud. Quo, botch, shud. And then the last one, well, as far as weather goes, or the weather turns. Zopil. Zopil. So that's our word for season, zolpil. So let's go to the beginning. Uhi hadab. Uhi hadab. Asgakab. Asgakab. Ashafwab. Ashafwab. Ukhalb. Ukhalb. Askakab. Askakab Ubakwob Ubakwob Khwekwadib Khwekwadib Katsatsu Katsatsu Squashab Squashab Kwobach Shed Kwobach Shed and Zulpil. Zulpil. So let's add. Slachel for day. Slachel for night. I don't know why I didn't put Dada 2 first. It's 
kind of what happens first. There we go. Good morning. There. So we got data toot, data toot, slachale. Remember that X wedge is that <laughs> sound. Slachale, slachale, and slachale. Slachel. Make sure you're making the S sound and the bar to L sound. Slachel. Slachel. If you're spitting, you're doing it right. Okay. So let's do a little work with some sentences. Let's say we want to ask. What season is it? That's going to be stop qui zol peel. Stop qui zol peel. And then if we want to respond with the season is spring. So remember in Lashutsi, eat everything, whoops, not that. Everything that comes after this is is what goes first in the Lashute seed. So, oops, that's gonna be Uhi Hadab Ki Zopil. The season is spring or spring is the season. Uhi Hadab Ti Zopil. So, Stab Ki Zopil, Uhi Hadab Ti Zopil. Let's say we want to talk about the weather. We usually say, "Does Chaltias Lachel? How is this day?" And you can use that with um, Lachel or Dadatu. We're going to start off with the day first. So let's say what kind of weather we got going on today. It's just raining, right? Cold. Altia, actually, let's do it this way. Altia slachel ukhob. Um, today it's rainy. So altia slachel ukhob. Let's pretend it's you know nice and warm out. Tias lachel us got cub. Today, where the literal translation is on this day, um, but that's how we say today in Lashut Seed. Today it's sunny. Um, let's see what else about Tias lachel day it's snowy or snowing however you want to say it i hope not i don't want the snow anymore it's nice for a minute but it's too much um what else we got yes lachel hmm. let's do us oops <clears throat> Today, oops, it's cloudy, which is also true. Okay, so stab quidzel peel. Ooh, he had a peedzel peel. As chal tia slachel. Al tia slachel u kolb. Altias lechel as gutkub. Altias lechel u bakwob. Altias lechel as katub. So let's talk about the morning weather. So let's say this morning it was, um, there was lightning. So, yeah, dada, two. Was lightning. I 
I don't know if we would put a prefix. I think that's the problem I ran into last week that I couldn't remember if you would. But we're going to just ignore that for now. Maltia Dada to Katsatsu. And it's coming up, coming down out there. I can freaking hear it. Altia Dada to us. Squishab. It looks weird with the two S's, but they're supposed to be there. So this morning, it's foggy. Altia Dada to us. Squishab. <clears throat> um let's do oops, one more morning. Where about that to it? This shelf club. This morning it's windy. <coughs> Excuse me. So let's go from right here. As chal tias lechel. Al tias lechel ukhob. Al tias lechel as gakhob. Al tias lechel ubakhob. Al tias lechel as kakhob. I guess we should put as chal tia dadatu. How is this morning? As chal tia dada toot. Al tia dada toot katsatsu. Al tia dada toot as squishab. That's such a fun word to say because I always drop out that schwa squishab. As squishab. But if you need it to sound out the word, you can do that. As squashab. Anyways, moving on. Altia daratut as shafwab. As shafwab. Now, <clears throat> as chaltia slachel. Is tonight. How is this night? Altia slachel. Quadi. Whoops. But I always forget how to spell that. Tonight it's thunder. Uchwe Khadib. And obviously for night you wouldn't use gut pub <clears throat> because it's not gonna be sunny at night. Silly. Um cold. Right. It's rainy. Just normal weather for us. Rain. Altia Slachel. Mm, is there one we haven't used yet? Let me go back over here. I think we've used most of them, so. Um, it'll be cloudy again. So tonight, it's cloudy. So let's go up to the morning. As chal tia dada tut. Al tia dada tut katsatsu. Al tia dada tut as squishab. Altia dada tut as shafwab. As chaltia slachel. Altia slachel u hue quadib. Altia slachel u kolb. Altia slachel as kakub. Okay, let's see. What do we got next? Let's use shud. Shud. 
to see something. So us should should t kobach should would be I am seeing the rainbow. Us should chud t kobach should. I am seeing the rainbow or I'm see, I'm seeing, yeah. I don't know why I spread that out usually like that. I'm seeing the rainbow. Being very anyways. Um a should equals bot shed. You see the rainbow. As should chuff t kobach shed. Remember, anything with a floating W, you're going to be rounding your mouth and blowing out. As should chuff t kobach shed. Should chill up. I was going to go chuff first and then I chill up it. So let's go back to chuff. Kobach shed. We see the rainbow. And then we can assume chillup T. Oops. Or botch. Too many S wedges. <laughs> so assume chillup T. Kobach is you folks see the rainbow. Assume uh, chud T. Kobach shed. As should chuff t kobach shed. As should chuff t kobach shed. As should chalup t kobach shed. You dig it? We all saw the rainbow. Yeah, right. There's no rainbow out. Just rain today. Okay, let's move on to. Ah, which is our plants. Ah, dupe. Remember that raspy. Ah, dupe. Ah, dupe. Which is plants. First one, swawatdis is dandelion. Swawatdis. <clears throat> We call it, if you remember the animal words we've done in the past, swawat is cougar. Dis is a um, suffix for tooth or teeth. And so basically a dandelion is like a cougar tooth because it looks like that, I guess. Uh, swawat dis. Swawat dis. We have bobchud. You can boob chud if you want, but I always boob chud, which is horse tail fern. Boob chud. That's one of those words where I know what a horse tail fern looks like, but I can re never remember the English, only the Lishutsi. So I get really excited and then people don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Next one, tata'u. Remember those um, C's in Lashutsi are like a T-S sound, but when they have that little apostrophe above them, they're glottalized. So they're going to be a harder, like a puffing of air between your teeth. Tata'us. Tata'us. There's spit everywhere. Tata'us. And that is... Oops. Thimbleberry... Sprouts? Sprouts. Tata'us. <clears throat> Next, studs, studs, which is nettles or stinging nettles. I guess we should put stinging. Are there nettles that don't sting? Studs. That D raised Z makes that Z, z sound. The X wedge is a sound. 
And we know that C is like a hard um, puffing of air between your teeth. So let's kind of practice the first st, 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 and then zh, 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 stadzh, stadzh. That one's a fun one to say. Stadzh. Next we have abid, which is camus root. Abid. Another one of those glottalized C's, those glottalized T-S sound. Abid. Abid. Next we have shagua'ats. <coughs> shagua'ats is salmon, <clears throat> excuse me, berry sprouts. Shagua'ats. Shagua'ats. Make sure you're pausing for that glottal stop. Shagua'ats. <clears throat> Chalas. Oops. Chalas is bracken fern. Now be careful how you say this one because if you say if you say it like this, chalas with the schwa instead of an a back there, this word means hand. So yeah, make sure you're pronouncing both those A's correctly. Chalas. Chalas. Um, oops. Wrong font. Ch adats. Ch adats is the June plum. The June plum. Ch adats. Ch adats. And pi ots. Pi is cedar. <clears throat> so let's kind of practice this in pieces. <laughs> Make sure you're not adding anything. I think sometimes there's a well, not that. There's a schwa. Some people will put that schwa. Chapai arts. But I always just kind of take it out for the chapai. Chapai arts. Chapai. Chapai. And then chapai arts. Chapai arts. So let's go to the beginning. Ach dupe. Ach dupe. Remember, back of the teeth and tongue for that. Uh, running man. Ach doop. Ach doop. Swawap dies. Swawap dies. Bob hud. Bob hud. Tataus. Tataus. Studs. Studs. Abid. Abid. Shagwa at. <clears throat> Shagwa at. Chalas. Chalas. Ch arat. Ch arat. And pi at. Pi at. So we remember this from last week. Olachad. Olachad is to gather from nature. Olachad. <clears throat> okay, shuffle through all my papers here. Olachad. <clears throat> so if we wanted to say, let's let's gather, let's gather from nature. Ru ola chad chash. Ru ola chad chash. Remember when we did um, our prefixes that hlu is intentional. It hasn't happened yet, but it will happen. 
a llu olach a chell. Llu olach a chell. So, let's go ahead and llu olach a, oops. Ich hai ats. What are we, what, what are we gathering? Cedar, let's gather cedars. Llu olach a chell tich pai ats. Llu olach a chell tich pai ats. Llu olach a chell tich pai ats. Shigwa Ots again, salmonberry sprouts. So let's gather salmonberry sprouts. Lu Olacha Chesti Shigwa Ots. Sorry, I dropped out that schwa. Shigwa Ots. I do that a lot. Um, so let's step away from Lu. And do u olachad chashti chalas gathering fracking fern just just one <laughs> if you want to get into um pluralization we could probably do that next week u olachad chashti chalas. Um, next, Olachad Chalup. Let's use Chalup. Tis Tudz. Olachad Chalup Tis Tudz. Father, no, gather. You didn't father nettles. You folks gather our gathering. Sorry. U olacha chalapti studs. Next, Olachad Cha. Let's do Cha. What are you going to gather? How about the Bob Hud? U olacha Cha, the Bob Hud. Um, you are gathering Bobhud, horsetail fern. Telling you, u olachad chafti Bobhud. So let's let's go up here. Actually, let's go through the whole thing, the whole the whole dang thing. <clears throat> Ach doop. Ah, dupe. Swawat dies. Swawat dies. Bob hud. Bob hud. Tataus. Tataus. Studz. Studz. Tabid. Tabid. Shagwat. Shagwa'ats, chalas, chalas, ch'ach arats, ch'ach arats. Remember that C wedge is like a ch, ch just a ch sound, but when you have it glottalized, it's like a harder ch, ch, ch'ach arats. Oh my God, I can't even speak. It's such a Tuesday. Ch'ach arats. Chwarats and Pai Ats Pai Ats Olachad Olachad and Slu Olachad Chash Slu Olachad Chash. I'm telling you, the rain is distracting me. It's so freaking loud. Slu Olachad Chash Tih Pai Ats Slu Olachad Chash Tih Pai Ats. See, I did it again. I dropped out that schwa. Shlu olacha chashti shagwa'ats. 
U olacha chalti chalas. U olacha chalapti stud. And U olacha chafti bob chud. Okay. Because that's obviously what's on my mind to hear something. It's lewd, chud, tea, cold. I hear the rain. Or I'm hearing the rain. Same. Rain. I quit. I quit everything. So us lewd. Remember that X raised W is just blowing out. Do. Try it with the D. Do. Do. Us lewd. Us lewd. <clears throat> us lewd chad ti kolb. Us lewd chad ti kolb. There. I acknowledge the rain. Maybe it'll leave me alone. <laughs> okay, so we've done olachad. We've done the different plants. Mm. I think. Let's do this one. This one's fine. Olachad chat ti ach du. U olachad chat ti ach du. We gathered. <clears throat> what if we want to say today we gathered plants? You're going to drop in an altias lachel. U olachad chat ach. So today we gather. So Altia Slachel U Olacha Chastik Achdu. Let's do some little practice sentences before we move on to berries and stuff. We're going to get taken away. It's a flood. I don't know if anybody can hear it, but I can hear it. I mean, that sounds weird. Whatever. Um, so. We, oops. Sabquad Zuhoi. We did this one last week. And that is, <clears throat> what are you doing? Stab qui odds uhoi. <clears throat> now in Lashutzi, we usually just kind of take out that I and blend those words together. So it comes out as stab quads uhoi. Um, but you can stab qui odds uhoi, either or. Um, so today I will gather. What are we gathering today? Let's do June. Plums. I don't think we need to put the. We just put plums. Yes, lachel. U or hu olachad. Chad t. Ah, is the word? Ah, yes. Al ties lachel, lu olachad chad ti ch adats. Let's see. It's rainy today. Sorry. So with this one, we're going to start with the butt, which is hoy. Hoy. And you can either uphold altias lachel, or you can reverse that and hoy altias lachel uphold. Either pretty much says the same thing. So hoy altias lachel uphold. Um, not er. Tomorrow, 
So Hoy, we haven't, I don't think we've done uh, tomorrow in the Zoom classes. So that's gonna be that. All qui clu do quish dot. Hoy, all qui clu do quish dot. Das gub. So that's kind of like the clu and us coming together. We call it like prefix smashing. So you don't need to say clue us. You just uh, class. Hoy, all qui clue do quit dot class gub. So, okay, I will gather plums tomorrow. Ob. Oops. Ola chud chud teach a dots. I'll quit do do quit Okay, ob. I remember from um, obiel or us obiel. You just take out that ob and it's okay. Ob clu ola chud chud teach a dots. I'll quit Okay, I will gather plums tomorrow. That's a cute little brief little conversation. So now let's move on to Bellies. So squall, does it do that? Squallashlad. Squallashlad is <coughs> berries in general or fruit. It can be either or. Squallashlad. Got that hard Q that comes at the back of your throat, but it's also got the W, so you're blowing out. Squallashlad. Squall. Ashland, school Ashland, and first berry up, Guad beef, Guad beef, blackberry, Guad beef. So we got Guad, we got beef, Guad beef. <clears throat> so school Ashland, Guad beef. Then Swadach Swadach Obewi Swadach. So that's a fun little glottal stop that just kind of pauses the whole Swadach. And then you just Swadach Swadach. So Squalashlud Gwadbi. Swadach. And then we have Chokoba Raspberry. Chokoba. 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 Um. Oops. Stabbed, stabbed. <clears throat> Look at the red elderberry, stabbed. So you're gonna, that's some interesting sounds. St, st, but, but, it's like but without the U. Oh, I know that's weird. Stabbed, stabbed. But remember in Lachute Seed, if you've got all those um, letters in a word, you have to pronounce them all. <clears throat> stopped, stopped. Next, aka, aka is um, salal berry. Nope, not that. Salal berry, aka. 
So you got the glottalized T and the back of the throat Q. Ah, pa. Ah, pa. The guad, which is salmonberry. I always think it's weird we don't really pronounce that L. Salmon, salmon. Anyways, staguad, staguad. Next. I can't read my handwriting. Colostub. <laughs> Colostub is service belly. Colostub. It's another one of those hard. Colostum. 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 And last, cheat you. Cheat you, which is a snozberry. Just kidding, it's strawberry. Okay, let's go to the top of the list. Colostum. Squalashan. Gwadbi. Remember that raised um, X raised W? <sighs> Gonna be blowing out. Gwad Gwadbi. Gwadbi. Swadak. Swadak. Make sure you're making that sound. Chalkhoba. Chalkhoba. <clears throat> Stabbed. Stabbed. Aka, Aka, Stagwad, Stagwad, Colostum, Colostum, Cheat you, Cheat you. So let's do little, little sentences with these. Oh, just what are we gathering? What are we gathering? My favorite is Chalkoba. Let's gather raspberries. Do Olacha Chasti Chalkoba. Do Olacha Chasti Stagwad. I gathered what's the quad? Salmon berry. Do you see taste object? So in Lashutzi, when we want to ask a yes or no question, we have this ooh, and it goes third in a sentence at right, like right after the chow word. If there's no chow word, then it just goes second. Um, but if you want to ask, if you see if you did something, it's um, used only for yes or no questions. So us shoot chuff ooh, t stopped. Us shoot chuff ooh. T stopped. Let's see. Let's do the mushy tea first. Let's shoot, shud, tea. Let's see the. Let's do okay. So now let's talk about what the berries look like. you. I always feel like there should be a glottal stop at the end of that one, and there never is. you. Is the strawberry bake? Hake means big, or I think it can mean great sometimes. 
depending on the context of your sentence. Hey, ku, so we know we're asking a yes or no question. Hey, ku ti street you. Is the strawberry big? So the only M's and N's that we ever use in Lashutsi, meat mon, tea steep you. Strawberry is small. Hey, ku tea steep you. Meat mon tea steep you. Let's do hawk ku tea. Swadah. Are the apple berries good? Hot uti swadah. Are the huckleberries good? Hot uti swadah. I love that word. It's just fun to say. The uh, huckle berries are good. So what if we want to say that they're not just good, they're very good? We're going to add an adverb, which um, in this case is going to be dite. Dite means very, or it can mean really too. Dite, hot, peace, what da? berries are very good. Diet hot tea swadak. Okay. So Sa'u T what's it or Kolastab? And that is are the service berries. Are the service berries bad? Sa'u T Kolastab. So sa is our word for bad. Sa u ti kolasta. Right, sa ti kolasta. Oh, very bad. This is not a general commentary on service berries. I'm just diagramming sentences for you. I like, I pretty much like all berries. Sa uti kolastab, dait sa, dait sa ti kolastab. Remember, we've got a glottalized Y here, so dait, dait, and then that glottal stop at the end of uh, bad. Sa, so dait sa ti kolastab. Ola khad chafu ti gwadbih. Ola khad chafu ti gwadbih. So we have the u just randomly right there. So we know this is going to be a yes or no question. And the question is, did you gather? I don't think we need the u then. I'll leave it there. Did you gather blackberries? Did you gather blackberries? So what if you want to say, yeah, I gathered like a lot. A is how we say yes. He would be a qui ha. So A is yes. 
I gathered a lot of blackberries. So we're going to name the blackberries and then Ukwik Ha, which is like of a lot. Um, so A, Uola Chad Chad Ti Gwadbi Ukwik Ha. And Ha means a lot. So let's use pa in a sentence. And I know we're running out of time. And I do want to get to the salmon um, really quick. So let's do one more sentence. Um, pa feed. Very haven't we used yet. Let's do taka. So pa teed taka. You'll remember that um, possessive D, which means my, aka is salal berries, and ka means a lot. So this sentence says, a lot are, oops, dwarf, are my salal berries. Or I have a lot of salal berries. So when you're talking about you have a lot of something or if something's bad or good or big or small, those um, adjectives, those descriptive words will come first. Okay, so let's, let's go over um, salmon really quick and then we can pick up um, on Thursday. Um, doing sentences with the salmon. So let's do hadot first. Humpy salmon. Hadot. Hadot. Got that glottal stop at the end, so it just kind of cuts it off. Hadot. Stake. is sockeye. Kind of sounds like it. So you've got that S and that C. St. So it kind of makes like a STS sound. Sorry. That's that that Q I gloss up. Next. Steelhead. And then my favorite, just because it's fun to say, quite, quite the dog salmon, quite. Uh, the easiest one to say, I think, is Yobuch. Although Hado isn't too hard, but Yobuch is king salmon. Yobuch. And last fish. Squaw wheats. Squaw wheats. Builders. Salmon. Just kidding. So, hado. Hado. Stake. Stake. Heuk. Heuk. I'm going to move the salmon now. Uh, white. White. Yobuch, Yobuch, Squawweets, Squawweets. So and those are our different salmons. I think I got them all, but there could be more. So now let's go back to the beginning and end this by going through all these wonderful words. First one, Uhit Hadab, Uhit Hadab. Us gut cub, us gut cub, us shafwab, us shafwab. Make sure you're making both those different S sounds. Us shafwab, ukalb, ukalb, us katab, us katab, ubakwob, ubakwob. Katsatsu. Katsatsu. 
Squashob. Squashob. Why does it feel like it's not there? I just want to make sure you can see my mouth when I'm making these sounds. Quobotch shud. Quobotch shud. Zulpeel. Zulpeel. Dada toot. Dada toot. Slachel. 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 For this word, you should be opening your mouth a little bit wider to make that A sound, which you don't have to do when you do slachel. 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 Stab quidzel peel. Uhi hadab tidzel peel. As chaltia slachel. Altias lachel ukhob. Altias lachel us gutpub. Altias lachel ubakwob. Altias lachel us kakub. As chaltia daratu. Altia daratu katsatsu. Altia daratu us quashab. Us squishab. Altia daratut us shafwab. Us chaltia slachel. Altia slachel u chwekwadib. Altia slachel u chwekwadib. Altia slachel u kolb. U kolb. Altia slachel as kakub. As kakub. Shud. Remember anything with the raised W, you're blowing out. Shud. As shud chud t quobach shud. As shud chud t quobach shud. As shud chuff t quobach shud. As shud chas ti quobach shud. As shud chalap ti quobach shud. Now on to kach dup. Kach dup. Swawat dis. Swawat dis. Bob chud. Bob chud. Tataus. Tataus. Studs Studs Abid Abid Shigwa Arts Shigwa Arts Chalas Chalas Chaharats Chaharats Pai Arts Chapai Arts Olachud Olachud Slu Olachud Chas Slu Olachud Chas Excuse me Slu Olachud Chas Tich Pai Arts Slu Olachud Chas Tich Pai Arts Slu Olachud Chas Tich Gua Arts Slu Olacha Chasti Shigwa Arts U Olacha Chasti Chalas U Olacha Chalapti Studs U Olacha Chafti Bobhud As Lud As Lud Chati Kolb. I hear it again. It's so loud out there. U Olacha Chasti Achdup. Altias la hail, U Ola had chasti ach dup. Stab quads u hoy. Altias la hail, Clu Ola had chadti chaquadats. Hoy, Altias la hail, U kalb. Hoy, Alquit Ludo quistat, 
Class Gukum. Class Gukum. Ob. Slu Ola Hacha teach a Huarat. I'll quit Sudo Kustar. Ob. Slu Ola Hacha teach a Huarat. I'll quit Sudo Kustar. Remember when you say tomorrow, it's that whole big whole phrase right there. On to our Skolashen. Skolashen. Gwadbi. Gwadbi. Swadak. Swadak. Chalkhoba. Chalkhoba. Stabd. Stabd. Aka. Aka. Stagwad. Stagwad. Colostum. Colostum. Stit you. Stit you. Slu ola hacha ti chokoba. U ola hacha ti stagwad. A shud chuff u. Teased abd. A shoot chud teased abd. Heg u teased jit you. Meat mon teased jit you. Hot u teased wadak. Hot teased wadak. Diet hot teased wadak. Sa u teased Dai sa ti kolastam. U ola chad chaf u ti gwadbif. U ola chad chaf u ti gwadbif. E u ola chad chad ti gwadbif a qui pa. E u ola chad chad ti gwadbif a qui pa. Ka teed. Aka. Ka teed aka. And then our salmon. Oh, you know, I forgot the most important word for salmon. And that is um, sulad, which I think is, the, is um, the one everybody's more familiar with. This is a general term for fish or salmon. Salmon. So sulad. Sulad. And then lad, lad, ulad, ulad. And then hado, hado, stake, stake, hake, white, white, yobach. Yobach and squawweets. Squawweets. All right. So that is our lesson for today. And we'll keep going over these words um, next Thursday or this Thursday. Sorry, I'm tired. Um, next week is going to be our last week for the Zoom classes. So just a little heads up. Um, if there's anything you want to learn last minute, we can do it. Um, otherwise, we can continue with um, the weather terms, the berries, and we'll definitely do more with the, the salmon. <gasps> Is that my grandbaby? Hi, Toby. <laughs> what a goof. All right. Deals hoist. Deals hoist, Toby.